survived the first week of school. Ugh. It is Friday evening. We're already in our pajamas. Uh, I'm tired. How was your first week of fifth grade? Hard. Okay, so I'm going to interview both of the girls, and we're doing, this is the first time I've done this, we joined a, um, a homeschooling YouTube mom Facebook forum, and uh, so some of the moms are doing a collaboration, and this is my first collaboration, and we just have the chorus of crickets and tree frogs that will be joining us, and... <sighs> I am ready for bed for sure. But after you watch our video, go look in the comments and go watch all of their videos. We're all going to be asking our kids the same questions and it's just going to be fun to connect with all the homeschool moms. So be encouraged and thanks for watching and thanks for watching all of my friends. Okay, are you ready? Yes. I'm going to ask you really hard questions. Ah. Go sit down. Banana. What? What grade? Did you just enter? Fifth. Fifth grade. How um, hard is that? And what is your favorite subject so far? It might change, but so far. Uh, definitely not math. Um, <laughs> That's new. I don't think this counts as a um, subject, but morning conference. That's my favorite. Oh. So that's fun. We started doing morning basket and a lot of homeschoolers are doing that. Read Aloud, bleh, Read Aloud Revival talks about her morning time, but Cindy Rollins is the one that really inspired me. And so that's new to us this year and we're calling it morning conference so that Poppy can join us sometimes if he wants and he can tell other people, oh, sorry, I'm in a conference call. <laughs> so what is your favorite school supply? We didn't really go shopping this year, did we? I don't know. But I bought you something new for the first day of school. What was it again? Remember? The little miniature. Oh, I liked the, um, the little miniature orca whale that Yaya got me from a gumball machine. That's and, not what and, I was talking about. And... Um... Mommy's little miniature erasers that were actually pencils. Pencil erasers. Okay. Favorite back to school lunch. I know what you're going to say. Lunchables? Yep. Um, is there anything you want to learn this year? I want to learn stuff with Poppy. Like computers? Computers, guitar, soccer. Okay. Um... If you could go on a field trip anywhere in the world, where would you go? Uh, I don't know. I know. Toys R Us. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Come on. No, I don't know. I don't know. The Statue of oh, Liberty, I know, I know, I know. Mount Rushmore, I know, I know. Yellowstone, Mexico, Australia, Can Antarctica. Can I talk? remember where it was now. Okay, if you think of it, we'll come back. Oh, no, I know, I know. Maryland. You want to go visit your friends. That's <laughs> Yes. Nice. Okay. Um, what do you want to be when you grow up? Hmm. A worship leader a and a mom. A worship leader and a mom. That's new to your list. The mom? I always wanted to be a mom. Okay. And I if you were allowed to have one or the other, which would you want? A extra recess or a nap? You know that one. Probably an extra recess. Now if I'm really tired and really sick, I'll be wanting to go to bed. Okay, what is your favorite thing to do for show and tell? Uh, something that's really easy and not part of school. It has nothing to do with school. So every Tuesday at CC, our classical conversations, they have to do presentations, and I make them do more specific things, but they would want to bring a stuffed animal every week if I would let That's them. That's what Lydia was saying. Okay, and if there's, last question, if there's one thing that you would change about the world, what would it be? I 
wish there were no there was no sin. Aw, that's <sighs> sweet. Hey, thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. <laughs> Here's my Lydia, the Didia. Pee Pie Momidia. Lydia. Okay. Go sit down. I'm going to ask you some questions. Ready? What grade did you just go into? Seven. Seven? I mean, second. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so how old are you? Seven. Oh, okay, that makes more sense. So what grade are you in again? For second. <laughs> What's your favorite subject? Uh, Timothy Time. Cursive. We're doing Bob Jones cursive, and the character in her lessons is named Timothy Time. I mean my instructor. Your instructor is Timothy Time. What is your favorite school supply? Markers. In the colors and our colors. And what's special about your markers this year? Smelly! They're smelly markers. Okay, uh, what's your favorite back to school lunch? Chocolate French toast. Oh, we do chocolate French toast for breakfast on the way to co-op. So we'll let that count. What do you want to learn this year? How not to do school. Yep, that does not surprise me. If you could go on a field trip anywhere in the world, where would you go on a field trip? Hawaii. Ooh, I like that. Okay, tell me, what do you want to be when you grow up? A chef for Jesus. A chef for Jesus. I like that. So, are you going to cook for Jesus? Or are you going to cook and somehow let that be for God's glory? No, I'm gonna tell people about Jesus when I when I'm gonna tell the people who work for me. I'm gonna tell them to to tell to tell Jesus people about Jesus and not for the people who get served to tell you about Jesus. But you but they can do that anyway. Oh, okay. But you tell them first. So a Christian restaurant. Okay, I get and it. And it's going to be outside. Out, an outdoor restaurant. Yeah, but if it gets too cold and or too hot, no, it's going to be canceled. Okay. But maybe if you go to Hawaii, you could do it all longer. Okay. Yeah. If you could only have one thing, would you want an extra recess time or would you want nap time? Extra, extra, extra. Recess. Yeah, I figured. What's your favorite thing to do for show and tell at CC? Uh, I don't know. Do you want to show them what you're going to do this Tuesday? Uh, nope. I brought it out here. Tell them, tell them what you're going to talk about this Tuesday. Patches. Patches are donkey. Okay. And Last question. If you could change anything in the world, what would you change? No school. And we already know everything. No school and you would already know everything. Mm -hmm. That's it's two things. You can only change one thing. Hello. Know everything. You would change that you would know everything. Except the uh, stuff that Jesus only knows. Except the stuff that only Jesus knows? Yeah, I don't want to change that. I want that to be that. Okay. Can you say thanks for watching? Thanks for watching, and I'll do my presentation, and I'll do my presentation to you soon.
yeah, watch watch for next Tuesday's video and you'll see her presentation. Good night, sweet girls. Okay, thanks for watching. Don't forget to look in the description and see all the links to all the other homeschool YouTube mama co collaborators. And we will see you later. Goodbye.